Hello everyone and welcome to my YouTube channel. Today in this tutorial we'll write a Python program to find out the square root of given number. So the input of this program is we'll take a number and here we can take a integer number or float number but we need to take the positive number. Here we are calculating the square root of positive number and we'll get the square root of that given number as the output. A square root of a number is a value that when multiplied by itself, it will give the same number. So for example, square root of 4 is 2. So when I multiply 2 with itself, that is 2, I'll get this value, same value, 4. Square root of 100 is 10. When I multiply 10 with 10, I'll get 100, this value. So let's write the program. So in the program, first we'll ask the user to enter the number. So I'll take a variable n to store the user entered input and here I'll take input here I'll write a message and we are using python 3 and in python 3 by default this input function will take input as the string value but here we want number integer or float right so here I'll take the integer number first so I'll convert the user entered input to int Alright, so now we are done with the input. We'll take the input from the user and we'll store that integer input in the variable n. Next, we need to calculate the square root of this number n, right? We can find out the square root of given number using two methods. One is we can use the power operator. Another one is we can use square root built-in function. So first we'll see how to find out the square root of number using power operator. First, I'll take a variable called result to store the square root, the output and here I'll take n power operator and 0.5. We can write the square root as a power of half also. For example, square root of 4 we can write like this also, 4 power half. So that's why I'll take n power 0.5 that is the square root. And next here I'll print the result. Okay, I'll print the result like this square root of n n is the input here is result result will store the output so let's execute this so it will ask enter the number so i'll enter number as 4 and here we can see square root of 4 is 2 so when i multiply 2 with 2 i'll get 4 100 or i can take as 8 like this we can find out the square root of the given number Next, if you want, you can take the float input also. Here you need to convert the input to float. And if I execute this now, you can enter the float value as the input. For example, if I enter 9.0, output is 3.0. Or you can take 4.4. Here we can see. Okay, so in this way, you can find out the square root of the given number using power operator. Next is you can use a built-in function called square root to find out the square root of the given number. To use that function you need to import math module because that function is defined in the math module. So first here you need to import the math module. Import math and next here I can use the square root function math.sqrt and inside this you need to take the value n. I need to find out the square root of n, right? That's why. So let's execute this. I'll enter the number as uh, 16. And here we can see 4.0. And I can enter, here we can see the value. Here math.sqrt function will return the square root of given number. And that will be stored in the variable result and we'll print that. Okay, so in this way, you can find out the square root of given number. So that's it for now, guys. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel. I will meet you in next class. Till then, take care.